thanks to you, we can search a much wider area. What would we have done without you, Avinia? <laughs> I haven't always been this way. In the past, I'd have just left you to fend for yourselves. No way! Why would you say something like that? Well, after leaving the village, I only wanted to be with Frostfang. I didn't want to deal with anyone else. At that time, riders weren't exactly welcome in Hunter's Towns. Things sure have changed, huh? Frostfang and I stayed on the move, avoiding other humans. Until one day, I met someone who changed my mind. Oh? Someone kinder than anyone else I'd known, always upbeat, no matter what. Humans are heartless. Why would I go out of my way to help another person? Don't say that! My town was also ruined by the Black Blight, but everyone's giving it their all to rebuild the place. Helping each other out. Isn't that what things are all about, chum? You know, maybe you're right. Perhaps I should go back and do my part in repairing the village. If it weren't for him, I wouldn't have returned to Kuon. And I'm glad I did. Now I know if we work hand in hand, we can really make a difference. For Ratha's sake, let's work together to find Old Day Day. tracks here too are these from a toby kadachi but why here <gasps> look up there <laughs> Thank you. 
stronger. Working together brings out the true power of kinship. By the way, the cool guy who changed your outlook? What's he like? Is he more claudacious than me? You think he's a cool guy, huh? That's a given, no? Well, Naviru, he's actually... Whoa! I just realized I'm totally starving! Let's head back, report in, and grab a bite! The windmill's close to completion from the looks of it. What else do you need? Someone pinch me. It's the legendary. Yeah! Ryder! Say what? Don't you mean legendary feline? Chief says you need parts for the windmill? Ah, uh, yes. Thing is... I'd need to go to the Jagged Rock Cave to get them, and it's not safe to go in. What? Why not? There's something in there that attacks people. Not a sound to warn you, and you're knocked out. It... it doesn't make a sound? It's true, I tell you. I'm not setting foot in that cave until someone sees to it that it's safe. <laughs> not gonna pretend it doesn't sound a little scary, but if we band together, we've got nothing to fear. Good luck. The windmill parts from that cave are the last pieces I need. The windmills really are impressive. Aren't they? They symbolize the strength of the bonds between us. They... they do? Ask anyone and they'll say the same. Without Avinia, there'd be no windmills here now. Huh? Come on, let's go to that cave. Yeah! Good idea! I said you're the one who made the windmills happen. Is that true, Avinia? To tell the truth, he was terrified of Frostfang at first. So, you mean he was against you coming back? That's right. 
But he seems perfectly fine around Frostfang now. Getting him and other villagers to accept Frostfang was a painfully long process. When I returned with Frostfang by my side, I was hopeful. At the time, the village was in really bad shape. There was even a monster living there. It seemed like a lost cause. What are we gonna do about that monster? Frostfang, let's go! Hey, it's Avinia! Did you come back to help us? Why else? Frostfang and I came back to do our part. I'm sorry about what I said to you. Stay in Kuan, please. Frostfang can stay too, of course. Okay, I'll stay. Let's rebuild our village together. They accepted Frostfang into the community, so we stayed. The windmills were the first things we rebuilt together. They mean so much to Kuan. They've come to symbolize all of us coming together, Frostfang included. Aw, I love a happy ending. And Frostfang became part of the Kuan family. Now, if we could only get people to trust Ratha, too. I know how you feel about Ratha. He's as special to you as Frostfang is to me. You want him to be accepted? Keep trying, and eventually people will come around. Yeah! And remember, you can count on me all the way! The monster in the cave is a Kezu. I'm sure of it. A long time ago, I got attacked by one and it knocked me out cold. This won't be easy.
Buddy, you've gotten stronger. It's all thanks to your bonds with different monsters. Keep it up, and you'll be a positively claudacious writer, just like the one who inspired Avinia. Who said that boy was a writer? Hmm? So, he isn't a writer? He tried his hardest to become a writer, but it just never worked out for him. If anyone should know that, it's you, Naviru. Ow! I think you're being a bit unfair. I never even met the guy. You've really forgotten him? Wait, so it's someone I know, like, personally? He never earned the title of Rider, but he did ride the Great Poogie. Though, the Poogie wasn't very pleased. No! No way! You mean to tell me it's... Jebly? Okay, let's get going. Look who's back! And pause for effect. We got the windmill parts you need! Welcome back, my friends. I see you've dealt with the Kezu. Of course, I expected no less from legendary heroes. Chief, this actually isn't the legendary ride. <laughs> Chief, you set the bar pretty high for us, huh? Thanks to your sweat and hard work, we'll have all the windmills working again. That's one thing off the to-do list. One thing? To-do list? Sounds like there's more. Yes, I've been too tied up here to look into the pit. I'd love to have your help, my friends. All right, let's get to the pit. Please, be careful out there. I'm not sure why, but the monsters near that pit have been acting up. You're telling me! The Zamtrios we met outside the village was not what I would call friendly. I see. Seems to be happening all around. The guild's calling the lights Rage Rays. Rage Rays? The strange light from the pits is what's enraging monsters. At least, that's the guild's theory. Light that makes monsters mad. You may run into some rage raid monsters by the pit. Keep an eye out. Don't worry about us, Chief. Let the legendary duo handle this. Thank you. Good luck, my friends. We've been searching far and wide, but still no trace of old Day-Day. The felines and I will keep up the search.